State your name and where you're from. Uh, Remox. What do you do here, Ray? Uh, I'm just open. Closing the bridge from the shift. And how old are you, Ray? Uh, I am 37. Okay, here we go. Welcome in. This is called Five Questions with a Bridge Operator. Today I'm here with Ray. Ray, are you ready? Yes. Yeah. Alright, Ray, how long did it take you to become a master bridge operator? <laughs> uh, not long. Um, just a uh, couple couple weeks of training and that was it. If you were giving a bridge operator nickname, what would it be? What would you call yourself? Uh, the bridge guy. Ray, how often do you have angry passerbys yell at you? Uh, so far this year, none, because it was the first time opening the bridge, but this usually uh, get a lot of people that flip you the bird here and there. So. How does it make you feel? You just kind of laugh at it. It's really got nothing to do with me. I'm just, you know what I mean, it's something I have to do. So just just laugh at it and just don't go. Right. What do you do to pass time while you're sitting here in the booth? Uh, just kind of just look at boats go by and people walking. And now I get to see the cars go over now. So before it was kind of boring when nothing here. So. Whoa. All right, Ray, and final question. What did you really want to be when you were a kid growing up? I really want to be. Uh, I wanted to work on cars. My father owned the shop and that's what I thought I'd be doing. All right, so there you have it. While everybody else is focused on the causeway and the bridge being open between Payton and Aram and the other part of Dartmouth over there that I don't even go to, I'm focusing on the real news, the real hard topics, the bridge guy. I'm Gazelle, this is Ray, and that's five questions with the bridge operator.